Hey guys, Logan here. We are closing in on the release of the two new maps, Lofoten Island and Province. These two maps are going to be released with update 4.4 that are supposed to go live before the end of August. A confirmed date and update notes are not released yet, but it will be very soon. So stay tuned for all that on my channel. The two maps were played by EA Game Changers at Gamescom just last week, and we were able to watch while they live streamed the gameplay. The maps are small with infantry only, and we got some images of the map layouts and some tips from the developers on how to succeed on these maps. Starting with Province, here we can see the map from the spawn screen for both Squad Conquest and TDM, and as I said, the maps are small. The playstyle is best described as fast and chaotic, and I get a feeling of that many players are going to use shotgun on this map. And here we have some tips from the developers on how to succeed on Province. Check the corners, no matter how fast you're moving, it can be the difference between staying in the fight or meeting a quick end. The many buildings are closed off, but that doesn't mean that they are all empty. Keep a sharp eye out for the telltale flash of a gun sight or glinting barrel aimed in your direction from a nearby window. There's always another way around. While the map is small, there are many ways to move around choke points and outflank your enemy. And here is Low Photon Islands, also playable in the game mode Squad Conquest and TDM. But maybe you can notice the difference in the pictures. Squad Conquest is played on one of the islands and TDM is played on the other. And here we have some tips on how to succeed on this map. Pinned down by fire from a nearby building. Demolish it with dynamite or other explosive to instantly remove their cover. The fish oil factory is surrounded by several wooden fences. You can shoot through these fences to open a flank or even set up an ambush for an unsuspecting enemy. When flanking under the docks, use the pylons for cover and don't forget to equip short range weapons. You may wonder why there only are two smaller game modes on this map. And I was wondering the same thing, but DICE has told us that Domination have been tested out on these maps as well. And they are likely to include it next time they are running a mixed playlist. The next patch will also include some changes to the spawns for the Morita map in the Conquest game mode. The changes are looking to prevent Axis soldiers from getting a free spawn on the other side of C, alongside some other minor spawn changes. There you have it! But one more thing before I go, I'm doing a giveaway and I will be giving away a Battlefield 5 PC code. To enter the giveaway just click the link in the description. But thank you for watching, subscribe for more Battlefield content, leave a like and comment your thoughts down below. Hope to see you in my next one. This is Logan, signing out.